Welcome, everyone, to the Everything Show, episode 853. I am your host, Matrix Lloyd 212, and I'm with Scott. What's up, Scott? Hello, everyone. What's up, Chris? I, 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 I. I know. Please excuse this. I didn't realize the shirt is so loud. This is the type of shirt that you get fired for wearing. So I'm just, I'm, I'm going to try not to wear that. Because, you know, maybe you could work for someone that's like a midlife crisis over 58 years of age. I don't know. Some quack. But anyway, try not to wear shirts like this to work. But anyway, guys, Chris, what do you got to tell us? Right away. Well, the reason that I said I, 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 of course, has to do with a certain character that has been revealed for the Power of Jesus. Yeah. Now... I I, 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 I have to admit, like, you know, I, I have liked pretty much everything that I've seen about this movie. Um, I'm, I'm not really a big fan of, of some of the Zords having like multiple legs, but you know, whatever. Yeah. Um, and I saw this and yeah. Yeah. Show it. Yeah. Please. Oh, what the hell? So that's supposed to be alpha five. Is that like a cross between Mantis and Ant-Man oh, and a spaceship with light yellow that? submarine? I mean, what is that supposed to be? I don't really know. Th- th- this is the type of thing. I've said this a couple. Of, I've said this a couple of times on casts in the past. When you want to change something, that's okay. If, right. you're, if you're changing something from source material, that's okay. As long as you respect the source material. I, and I think they did to, for for the most part. Didn't but, they? Then, but then, like I've said before, when you start changing things that don't need to be changed, you wind up with things that just don't make sense. Right. So somebody tell me. Why that looks like a purse. That looks like stocks. That looks like a purse. And they took lamps, uh, hot lamps, and stuck it for eyes. Right. Now, you want to know what the irony about this food is? Food at the same time. You want to know what the irony of this is? If I'm right, these two little lights, if these are not a reflection of these, which I don't think they are, Alpha used to have ones that used to go around his face, you know, in the cartoon, or not a cartoon, in the show. Right. So what? why do you need these? I, I don't, I'm, sure, I'm sure that there's going to be a reason in the movie, even if they're just eyes. That's like, his real eyes, though? I don't know what these are supposed to be. I guess they're supposed to be that, but like... What's that pile of shit in the middle? Is that supposed to be the face? What, this or this? The green shit in the dome is supposed to be like a cross between Mysterio and that's a vampire. Oh, this is, oh up on the top here. This oh, no, he, ha- he had a, a, something like this in the original one. It wasn't this big. but Just let me tell you something. This looks like the, the ball that goes around the, the, the thing on, on Las Vegas. Yeah. Where, like, it rolls. And it also looks like they real. those lighted tubes right on the other side. Right. And besides that... Let me see if I can get a better picture. It looks like the vacuum cleaner. How can you do that? It looks sucky. It looks like the vacuum cleaner. Oh, there's the full body picture of this. Oh, wonder. There's probably a reason for it. But yeah, I, I got to tell you, I mean, it's a small thing, but I'm not a big fan of the way he looks. Uh, yeah, I saw at least the first season of the first four episodes, three episodes. And Seven Zark Seven from from the uh, Battle of the Planets or Gotcha Man looked a hell of a lot better. You know, the picture? Yes, I have the full body one. This is from IGN, so go check that out definitely on IGN.com. What the fuck is that? What the hell? The fuck? First of all, it looks like he's hung over. He's looked like he, he got one too many cheeseburgers in that stomach. And he looks like he's Why a trans- he a belly? He looks like he's a I, transgender I robot. The female rangers and try to grind them. He looks like a transgender robot that likes to wear stockings for I don't know what the, the fuck. The that is. Look like they stole that from the original uh, War of the Worlds. Honestly, you, yeah, you're right. I, I, don't, I don't even know what the fuck this is. To tell you the truth. So, so I got to tell you, like, 
again, this is a minor thing. I'm still excited for this. That's movie. a minor thing. That's a. Yeah, I think it is. Movie. I think it's minor because he's not. He's not going to be like in the movie for the whole time. But, is this like a see through your red arm? No, this is worse than that. <laughs> you, you, know what, you know what makes me worry? Like, what is Zordon going to look like? Oh fuck! Oh, this. Like, fuck what this. is Goldar going to look like? Probably like a penis. Is that a tattoo or is that just bullshit on his arm? I mean, what is that supposed to be? I have no idea. I don't even know. This is fucking horrible, dude. So, yeah, I'm not a big fan of that design. No, not, not a fan. No. Not really. Um, other is- Power Rangers stuff was they had some more, like, uh, higher definition pictures of Rita. Okay. And it, it looks like in her staff... The green power coin might be in her staff, so we might be seeing the Green Ranger. Okay. <laughs> Why can't you have the big fucking thing? Like it's yeah, but that I have to say is awesome. Yeah, fucking great. I, I actually really like the way Rita looks, and uh, I like her design, and I like Elizabeth Banks, so I think she's gonna. Do I that. like Elizabeth Banks too. I mean, she looks a lot better than Poison and Ivy, I think, but whatever. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I guess I could see that. Um, other than that, that was the only Power Ranger stuff, I believe. Um, oh. we're sorry, folks. We're sorry. If the only Power Ranger stuff we gave you was this. I, 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 I. Yeah. yeah, no, it's just. No. <laughs> you know when you feel fakakta, that this is what. <laughs> There's nothing else? I mean, after that, I don't even know what the fuck to talk about. <laughs> there, was, there was something else, but, I mean, it, it probably would have been better in the last cast, but... Oh, it's a good thing related to our... <laughs> type of thing, or no? Yeah, actually. Um, which I thought right. was kind Played of funny. It over. I thought it was kind of funny. Why so, not? On the Star Wars show... Oh, yes. Gareth, Edwards was, Gareth Edwards was giving an interview, right? And they asked him, like, you know, so what was it like working on there? And, you know, you know did, did, you know, what's the, kind of the funny thing? Did some did something funny happen to you on set? And he was like, yeah, actually, more or less. He was like, yeah, actually, what, you know, I, we were on there. And we were doing scenes in Saw Gerrera's cave, which is um, Forrest Whitaker's character in Rogue One. Right. Okay. And he said that there's going to be a couple Easter eggs in the background of his cave. Yeah. And there are going to be cave paintings of Godzilla, the Mutos, and the monsters from his movie Monsters, right? Excellent. So I was sitting there and I was like, yes, this is just an Easter egg. Right. Yes, it really doesn't mean anything. Okay. However. 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 No one has to tell you that that doesn't mean anything. Correct. Yeah. E.T. showed up in episode one. Correct. In the, in the Galactic Senate. And let's not forget, in, the, in Gremlins, the movie Gremlins, the original movie poster for E.T. was in the back, it was in that uh, alley where they were yeah. all hoarding down there, but it had its original name. I don't remember what the name so, was. So, E.T. don't have the force, you're telling me. We talked about this off air. Yeah, no. Just, you know, okay, and um, there weren't a race in the Galactic Senate, right? That was just a bullshit Easter egg thing that wasn't real. They or they were are? there. They're there in the newest version. They were, well. right? Um, so, if it's a, and I, I said this, I have to repeat it. I said, if this is a long time ago in the galaxy far away, and episode eight and nine is a long time ago in the galaxy far away, how the fuck could Godzilla be alive if he's got a painting of him if it's the present day? Well, before before, before <laughs> anybody in the comments loses their mind, like, <laughs> it's not a it doesn't mean anything. Okay, listen. Yeah, 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 listen, we know, but we're just having fun. So just deal with it, okay? I mean, what the hell was, like, Darth Vader doing on Earth? I don't know. I mean, <laughs> yeah. If, You're saying that Han Solo's DNA became like Indiana Jones. I mean, this is ridiculous. No, again, but, but if if you wanted to, and, and nobody can tell you any other way, Indiana Jones is a clone of Han Solo. Okay, you could say that if you want. You just um, dropped him off, by the way. Okay, you're exactly a lightsaber. And Raiders of the Lost Ark. 
Right. I think they're in a cave painting as well. Or I saw R2-D2 by the, the Starship Enterprise, I'm just saying. but There you go. There you go. So one could potentially say that Godzilla and the Mutos exist in the Star Wars universe. And Godzilla's not a Jedi. Where's this? <laughs> they, well, if he is, then may the Lord be with all of them. Don't they have... <laughs> don't, <laughs> don't they have, like, a Sith monster or something? Would equivalency to Obi-Wan or would... <laughs> So, well, no, you, you know what's funny, though? And, oh, you know, I never told you. <laughs> you, you know what's funny? Told he told me enough. He told me you killed him. No. Okay. No, you, know, you know what's funny, though? In, in Clone Wars, there is an episode co- uh, where this creature is found on this. Uh, they, they're testing this, like, neutron bomb thing oh, shit. that can wipe out the, the droid army. It's like an, like an EMP pulse. Right. So they do that on this planet, and it wakes up this giant monster that they call the Zillow Beast. So, so well. Right. Yeah. So they bring it back to Coruscant because, like, we're going it, to – its arm it, – its skin is actually uh, – it can repel lightsabers, right? Okay. So they're like, if we take it back there, we could have lightsaber-resistant clone troopers. Ooh. It's like, hell yeah. But it gets out, and it starts causing a rampage. And all the Jedi are like, yeah, we can't handle that. That's too big for us to handle, and it's it's on a rampage. Right. So that whole episode was based off of Godzilla, obviously. Right. So we know that they're not opposed to having Godzilla references in the Star Wars universe. And they don't sue? Like, Legendary can't, like, make a stink about it? Or not really? No, because because technically, as long as they don't mention it, yeah, the, the company could be like, that's not Godzilla. That's this. What are you talking about? That's the Mutos, no, that's this. Because look at the it old It's, it's a, a weather balloon, not UFOs. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yes. Yeah, right. so I just thought that was kind of funny. And like when I read that, it was like my mind kind of exploded. I was like, wow, that's pretty cool. But as, of course, as we said before, it is just an Easter egg. So mm-hmm. yes. it doesn't mean anything. Correct. But you could, you could always imagine it to be true if you wanted to it doesn't the fact that it's going to be like like certain movies never put any porno in disney flicks oh stop it (laughs) now rescue rangers anywho um you read my mind well let's have a rousing conversation about emerald city (laughs) Oh Jesus God! <laughs> <laughs> Why? <laughs> oh my God! That's not. So was that we're gonna do, no, we're gonna do a whole the- not tonight. We're gonna do a whole cast on that. That's gonna be. A oh start. my God! In case you don't know what we're talking about, we're talking about NBC's <laughs> new version of The Wizard of Oz called The uh-huh. Emerald City, that oh, turns it into. Twilight, Vampire Diary, CW Romance. I would rather the Scarecrow the having his chest out like this on the course, like Jesus, and Dorothy like touching his chest. And I don't even want to like look like fake. You know, like, and it's just like you know, I mean, come on now, you know, like that's and and he's burned. But then, then she's in love with the Tin Man also. Uh, we wonder why. <laughs> and she has the Infinity Gauntlet, right? She's got two Infinity Gauntlets. Because I guess Ruby Slippers is out with the, you know, decades past well, te- last century. Well, technically, they can't say Ruby Slippers because in, because in the in the original book they weren't Ruby; they were glass or they were diamonds. So, hmm. so yeah, that's it's going to be horrible. Oh God! It's gonna be deplorable, I think. Oh God! Deplorable. Deplor- it's deplorable, I think. But <sighs> what else, man? There's some nice previews of the Legends of Tomorrow next. Yes. Week. Holy crap! Can't wait for that too. That's gonna be great. Reverse Flash, Damian Dark, Malcolm Merlin, and Captain. But then Captain Cold die, or whatever. The plans are the, the word is is that dark or the reverse flash is supposed to go back in time and grab uh, cold while he was still evil or bad and that's how that's how uh, the portraits of uh, how did he die again? 
he remember at the end of the uh, first season, he uh, he had to stay behind and keep that one generator uh, in sync uh, or the explosion. Oh, because they were they were going to blow up that one generator, but because something went wrong, he had to stay there and pretty much be the uh, the dead man switch. And he died. Yeah. And there's no way to save him. Well, like I said, Dark play. or Zoom is supposed to go back. Uh, pull him out of there. In time, and he's going to be part of the. the but is he going to pull the, him out of there or is he going to pull him out before when he was a villain? I think when he. I don't think he's going to be pulling him out then. I think he was going to be pulling him before he became a member of, okay. of the, uh, the league. That's going to be interesting. Yeah, that's the way I heard it. So. Mm. And that means that the timeline's going to be destroyed, right? Because they're screwing around, possibly. Hello? I guess that's it. You there, Chris? Hey, can you hear me? Yeah, what happened? We just lost. I don't know. Scott's frozen in time. All right. Scott's frozen in time, so we're going to get out of here. Take care. Bye for now.